Pletora provides analytics and machine learning algorithms, for example, uh, predictive maintenance. Uh, Perry brings all high computational functions to the cloud. Defi Tech is a deep learning platform provider for drones, robotics, surveillance cameras, and data center usages. Omnitech is based around Xilinx parts, and we do uh, basically image processing and image analysis in a wide range of different technologies. We have the move to Ultra HD images. We have also 8K images on the horizon. Perone Robotics is a software development company, and our focus is on autonomous vehicles. So we create a platform that enables OEMs and other providers of vehicles to quickly and easily integrate different sensors, integrate different control logic, and control their vehicles autonomously. iTech Digital Systems is a cutting edge eye tracking technology company. It's ideal for automotive applications, uh, VR, AR applications, medical device and diagnostic solutions. LiFi is high speed data communication through LED lights. It's similar in speed to current Wi-Fi technologies. Typical cybersecurity solutions today takes 200 days. PAP detects and remediate in milliseconds. Uh, ZeroTech is one of the first batch users of our products. They're the second largest drone company in China. For now, they're building AI drones with our products, so we integrate a Zinc device inside for embedded vision, uh, for object detection, pedestrian detection, and gesture recognition. A big part of what we're doing here at Aperi is, is trying to bring a lot of these sort of large-scale practices from the cloud and from higher-level software development into sort of a contiguous pipeline from like the IP core vendor to the delivery of the product as an application. At Perone Robotics, we're finding the partnership with Xilinx to be very interesting because we have a software platform that is modular and is capable, and we see that same kind of capability in the Zinc MPSOC, which has the dynamic ability to apply machine learning functionality or techniques uh, in a modular and flexible way that suits our software platform very, very well. You have the MPSOC, which is the, the evolution of the Zinc, and the beauty of that is that you have all that power at your hand, you know. We have everything there. The Xilinx technologies uh, have, um, have helped us rapidly iterate and evolve our core algorithms and uh, processing that makes life possible. Having access to the all programmable technology from Xilinx allows us to um, have algorithms running at the performance levels necessary to process high-speed Li-Fi data in real time. And we're finding now that the same technology that we developed for use in television special effects is now being used in a huge range of other industries, from medical imaging through industrial and scientific imaging, um, uh, machine vision and automotive applications. One of the things that, that really intrigued me with the, the, the Xilinx SOC family, Zinc, is the combination of the, the features uh, that are there. It allows me to do a lot that I can't do anywhere else. And now we're moving into deep learning and the powerful Zinc devices that both the logic and the ARM CPU allow us to do more number crunching. We started using Vivaro, then we found Vivaro HLS, which at the beginning we couldn't believe is it is real or what. Then we found SDSOC. It was again amazing because they just have to program it and there you go. So we were like, wow, let's start doing things.